welcome back because I'm trying to get y'all straight on this tripod and such so <sighs> I think it's been about nine months or so since you guys have actually seen your girl have a stitch of makeup on but I have to tell you guess what today your girl's got makeup on she's got foundation stuff in the eyes a little off but it's a little off but it's because I was heading out today and we saw a horrific accident on the highway mm. and there was some fatality involving a child or children Baby. as we saw um, their car seat um, sprawled and sprung all over the interstate. So I had makeup on but as you can see it's you know. Mm. So right now I wanted to do this a video with you guys. And um, why I enjoy my vitamin water. Have you guys ever tried this vitamin water? I love this vitamin water. Anyway, um, I wanted to, that was squeaky. Anyway, anyway, I wanted to do this um, video with you guys. The name of this video is the seven weirdest things. No, the seven weirdest beauty tools from Japan that you can actually buy, no lie, straight, 100 legit, straight up. So the first one, you guys, are you ready? Here we go. <coughs> yes, y'all. What in the heck tarnation was that? So let me tell you exactly what that is. It is a Bigen Beauty Face Expander. Hmm. Sold for $88. Um, it says, don't uh, just sit around wishing for a wider. Okay. Squish your face. Hmm. Okay. Um, take action with this cheek muscle training tool that allegedly stretches your skin to prevent it from sagging. Yeah. Okay. Um, we'll go ahead and leave that to the mother nature because I'm not thinking I'm going to walk around looking like that. I don't know about y'all, but not I. So, the next one. Are y'all ready? I am absolutely petrified over this one. Here it goes. <coughs> yes. Y'all saw that mess, you guys. It is a... Uh, Makazumi, excuse me if I'm saying it wrong, Robo Ingrown Toenail Fixer sold for three, three hundred and nine dollars. There's no way anybody is putting that monstrosity on any part of my body and it looks like it screws up and then it just rips your t ingrown toenails from in between the crevices and flings them everywhere or something. But it says for the low price of $308, you can buy yourself a fancy little contraption that manually pries your painful ingrown toenail from the nail bed, you guys. With two hooks and a tiny crank. Oh, ma'am. Uh, and it also says proceed at your own risk. So here is the next one. Yep, I don't even know what to say on this one, guys. So, my TV is kind of possessed. You guys, this is a breast gymnastics hand massager. Um, I don't need nothing massaging nothing to mind my, my boobies or nothing, you know. I don't need nothing massaging there, you know. For 51 bucks, you can get your boobies massaged. For when you're own hands are too convenient. There's a breast gymnastics hand massager, a plastic claw shaped like a rake that massages, we use the word lightly, <laughs> your breasts into perkier state. If the concept didn't completely define modern medicine, you guys, and gravity, yeah. I'm a little scared off this one. So here's the next one. Here we go, y'all ready? <laughs> For 53 bucks, you guys, you can get a face wear exercise mask. I don't know about y'all, but I am definitely not walking out in the street or even walking around my house like that. 
It says, based on its design, the only thing more terrifying than this stretchy mask is a wrinkled face. Apparently, after five minutes a day, the face wear claims to stretch and tighten the skin and facial muscles blah, 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 for a younger, more radiant you. And it says it's also great for robbing your local bank. Hmm, that's comforting. I don't think I want to rob a bank, nor do I want to look like that. I don't know if I would spend any money on any of these things, guys. Um, here's the next one. This one kind of disturbs me, but here we go. This one is actually a Fute Compass Makeup Eyelid Brush. Yeah. For 44 bucks, I'll pass. Um, it says the brush on, wait, the brush on this makeup tool swivels back and forth to draw a crease along hooded eyelids. We're little distracted by the fact that the brush appears to be a plastic pizza cutter like wheel that you can dig into your eye area, which seems more harmful than helpful. Huh? So. Are y'all ready for this one? Yup. What in tarnation is that you guys say? I'm about to tell you. For a hot 73 bucks for $73, you can get an inverted nipple suction dream charm adjuster. I'm going to repeat. An inverted nipple suction dream adjuster charm adjuster for 73 bucks ain't nothing adjusting nothing up here okay that is frightening to me it says like a dyson vacuum for your boobs this effeminate pink sucker will gently unstick even the most stubborn of any any not any any i and n i e nipples and don't worry, the attachments come in three sizes, guaranteeing that no nipple will be left unfreed. Okay, no ma'am. And the finale is... Oh! Yeah, a facelift at once face trainer for a hot 71 buckaroos. Meet the hands-free shake weight for your face. Just stick the end of this little vibrating gadget into your mouth and let the intense pulsations magically melt away your excess fat. Fine lines and all the signs of aging that will scar you, or that you got scarred. No, that scar you got as a kid. No, whoever made these, you have completely frightened me. These are absolutely true. They are from Allure magazine, as I'm showing you here. These are tools that you can legit purchase. I'm not kidding at all. <laughs> um, yeah. When I saw this from Allure magazine, I was like, you guys have disturbed me for the day. Maybe for like a few hours, but you guys have freaking disturbed your yeah, girl. So I still know. Some of those are like frightening me to like be on like who and a, a nipple? What? You want to do what to my nip? <laughs> you want to, sorry my daughter's in the back. You want to, excuse me, you want to suction out my nip like a, like a Dyson vacuum? What? Right. No. <laughs> so, oddly enough. Weird things, you guys. So I do have another weird video coming up for you guys. I hope you enjoyed this one. This is just some weird things that I came across. I thought I would do a video on that were a little interesting and a little off the wall as well. Why your girl had a little bit of makeup on and wasn't looking like a ghost. I probably look like a ghost in this video because I have some, some serious highlighter going on. So I might look like Casper the Ghost instead of anything else. Okay. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget I am running a 300 subbies giveaway. So just... The link to that giveaway is in the description box down below, and the official rules will also be at the end of this video. So if you're not a new subscriber, make sure you hit the subscribe button down below. As always, guys, I want you to stay blessed, stay warm, unless you're on the island somewhere. And I will catch you guys on my next video. 